All right, we're going out about now because Saturday, 5,000 or so people will gather not near the Willamette River, not along the Willamette River. They will be in the Willamette River and they're taking part in this annual event. It is called the Big Float because it's big and it's been going on now for nine years. And the guy who started the Big Float convinced me to float in the river with him. I'll start with this, Willie. <laughs> I can't actually believe that you got me out here only because I have a slight fear of the water, but this is actually pretty cool. Right on. Well, I'm <laughs> glad you were able to make it out. And I love this shot looking down from above. Uh, we look pretty tiny here in the mighty Willamette River. Let's start with the beginning though. Let's talk about nine years ago, you started the big float, Willie Levinson. Why did you do this? Well, you know, I was looking away for a way to impact the conversation on how people related to the river. Once you have a chance to get into the river, if you're somebody who loves rivers and, and water, it's transformational. As Portland gets uh, denser, it's going to be very difficult to add more green space. The Willamette is Portland's blue space. It's this untapped resource that is a quality of life issue. You know, Portland really has no idea what's about to happen to it once we really embrace the river. Since the initial big float nine years ago to now, how have you helped improve people's relationship with the river? Well, number one, we want to create platforms for um, giving people an opportunity to have an ex a positive experience with the Willamette River. So we opened up Poets Beach. We opened up uh, Audrey McCall Beach. We started the River Hugger Swim Team, you know, to give people an opportunity to do uh, recreational um, open water swimming. People recreating in rivers is something that's in our DNA. Final question, how do we know when we're done floating? When we get hungry, I guess. This is pretty comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not hungry, let's keep floating. Yeah, let's keep floating. <laughs> Willie Levinson, I know uh, Nina, you've done some He's stories great. with Willie. He's... And I was saying that he moved here 24 years ago. I was 20 years ago, and when we both got here, that was the message. Do not go in the Willamette right. River. And I just kind of said, okay, I won't. He said, let's change that. And he's been working hard for 15 years to change people's perception mm -hmm. of the river. As he likes to say, it changed people's relationship with the Willamette River. And it is impressive to see uh, when they started the big float nine years ago, a few people showed up. Last year, 5,000 wow. people showed wow. up. So it's quite the scene. The message Saturday. is sinking in. Yeah. Yeah.